Hey, this is Dave with the Shepherd School, and I got my wife in the kitchen because I'm gonna have show her something I seen on the Facebook. Those crazy Russians, they do some interesting videos where I got the idea for the plastic rope video. Unfortunately, I don't understand what they're talking about, so I don't know how to do the how-to. But I saw somebody making, uh, taking a soda bottle and using it as a sausage press along with some skewers to make little meat sticks. So I've got a bunch of these bamboo skewers. I've been having them soak it in cold water for 30 minutes or so. I've got a clean soda can and I took a soda bottle and cut it down to where we could use it as a piston. I've got a nice meatloaf recipe here. And what we're going to try to do is take us a ball of the meatloaf. We're going to shove it inside our jar. Just like we're doing sausage, we have a sausage stuffer. Take our soda bottle, push out the air. Put a skewer in there. And it's magic! That's really cool. You like that? That's neat. We're making hot dogs. Hey, William. Meatless dogs. What's the hot dog song? Hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog. Hot dog, hot, hot diggity dog. <laughs> Sing it again. Hot dog, hot dog, hot dog, hot dog. You're silly. Don't see a treat. You see it? Shh. All right. Meatloaf on a stick, William. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, that's cool. You think that's cool? I think it is. You think that's neat? Yummy. Yummy meatloaf. Luckily, I kept the recipe in the 21 day fix approved range so my wife can try it out. Let's see, the mommy person can try it. Then he gets your treat. Don't you see your treat? You see it? Let's see what happens. Let's see. Okay, so we made our little beetle hot dogs. Uh, had enough left over to make a little spring form pan of uh, loaf. We're going to bake them for a little while, come out and then douse them up with some sauce, and then finish off in the oven again. Um, I'm just guessing on the times, but I'm going to keep it at 350, and I think after maybe 30 minutes or so, they'll probably be good. All right, here they are in their meaty goodness. Some of them I have put some sauce on, and some I have left plain for the wife's diet, even though I really don't see. Have a little bit of honey and ketchup. We'll uh, totally tear it up, but anyway, I think they look pretty good. We're just going to let them rest for a couple of minutes, and then uh, see if the boy will eat them, because he's talking about eating meatloaf on a stick. <laughs> you like it? You, you want to eat it on the stick? You don't want me to take it off the stick? Daddy took his off the stick. That's okay, Daddy. Okay. So, they taste pretty good. I mean, they're it's meatloaf, right? Yeah. But I will say, uh, I think if you made it with a gyro recipe, you know, with some salt, and let it um, firm up, and then cooked it on a barbecue, it would be really awesome. But it's pretty good. The boy likes it. I like it. Haven't heard from the wife yet if she it's likes awesome. it. She says it's awesome. So uh, there you go. Got to find those crazy Russians on Facebook and then uh, steal their ideas. So thank you very much.